step, watch it settle, drive, and double tap. Right? We'll see what that looks like first. Anytime the targets are about a yard apart, you want to be less than tenth of a second difference from split to transition. <laughs> that little guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so hey guys, take a moment to dry fire because you haven't even had your pistols on at all yet today. Up command, you'll draw and fire two rounds into each target. Left to right. Left to right. Ready. Up. Ready. Up. It's going great so far, man. We're just getting to kind of the end portion of our first training group, and these guys are taking what they've learned, and we're kind of putting them in almost in like a stage format, and they might find themselves in a competition. So a lot's happening here. We got some short transitions, some extreme wide transitions, some forward entry, some shaving of dead time on the draw, and some wider transitions on the back. So uh, I'm asking these guys to do an awful lot in three hours, and they're responding really well. Not here, not here, but here. You have to be able to push, push the movement here because this is where it matters. If you take care of what's here, right here, right now, everything over there is gonna take care of itself. If you start worrying about what's there, you're already behind the game. Because you're boom, you're already thinking, you're still thinking, whatever. That's gonna F up your leaving, timing, leaving, eventually. Does that make sense? All right, I want the whole entire line to line up over time. Ready? Your legs are loaded, like my legs are split apart, my hips are locked, and I'm in aggressive, my toes are clamped down. I don't want to see that, I want to see this. It's a very small move. We're not taking a step forward, just letting the gun come up to the high red. Five. Six, again. You see your gun. On the, or type picture on target after the first shot, too late. Again. Man, it's been going great so far. I mean, I had a lot of excited energy um, coming in today, and I couldn't. I remember texting Max this morning at 5:30 in the morning. Him and I were texting, and his, my last text to him was, "I can't wait because this is going to be a great day." I'm sorry for asking all these questions because I'm super excited, and the excitedness is really just being able to possibly share the stuff that I'm about to share with these guys, right? The movement part, which I kind of like to share, and expose to, and then you see that light. The bubble, the bulb, I mean, the, the bulb that turns on, that, that oh crap moment, like, oh, I've been missing out on this. And it's such, something so simple that when you show them and you, you keep putting names on it and you, they all can identify them as something tangible, now they can relate and they can go, yep, that was kind of what I needed. And that's kind of what I want because now every one of these guys that walk away from here, now they're taking a, part, a piece of me with them. Ready? Stand by. I think you probably need to ask the students, but I thought it went really well. I tried to give them a lot of information in a short period of time. You know, I'm not used to working with a big group in such a small period of time. And I think once we got rolling, they were they wanted to keep on shooting. You know, I gave them some good solid stuff and they all know that they, you know, they need to go home and work on these drills and the fundamentals at home. But I had a great time. It's a good group, very uh, astute, and it's uh, all you can ask for. Awesome. You know, the weather couldn't be better here in Vegas in March. It's just absolutely perfect. We're probably about high 60s, low 70s at the moment, some light wind. It's great. Everybody's truly enjoying themselves. We just spent our first three hours with the first shooting pro. My guys went through several different transitions and a little bit of movement. So I asked them to do an awful lot in three hours and they responded really well. And it's, uh, it's going extremely smooth. So it's going for it.